Today we've got some more mask figures from CFCB Unlimited and some new and exciting news. Welcome back. Now, I've just received my latest order from CFCB Unlimited, which now brings me fully up to date with the figures that were released back in the day in these two packs. So we have Sly Rax, Cliff Dagger, Matt Tracker from the Rhino, and Buddy Hawks. Now, I'm not going to give you a full-on review of these. My opinion of these is the exact same as it has been on all these figures I've received, which is they are solid, they are very well made, the painting is accurate, and these are just upscaled versions of the figures that we enjoyed as kids. And I have had people say that they're not worth having because there's no vehicles. Again, just to go over old ground, my first mask toys were figures, so for me getting just figures, not a problem. Secondly, a few people have commented that they don't have painted faces, well duh. The originals didn't have painted faces, and these are exact representations of the old mask figures, but done in three and three quarter inch scale. So, very happy with these. I'm happy that I've got the complete lineup of mask figures, plus the two females that we didn't get, you know, back in the day. So in terms of exciting news from CFCB Unlimited, you will know if you've been watching my mask videos from CFCB that we were missing one figure. Well, good news. Dusty Hayes is on his way. He's not ready for order yet, but we are getting the Dusty Hayes from the Gator in three and three quarter inch scale. So if like me, you were a bit worried that we wouldn't have a complete set of wave one figures, fear no more. He is on his way, as is a Gloria Baker in cartoon colors in classic mask scale. All good and exciting news. There are other figure lines coming from CFCB that they will want to announce in due course, but I had a sneak peek. All very exciting, and as always, link in the description, and I believe there is a discount code for all things 80s, that will also be in the description. So, once again, I am completely over the moon with these figures. They are fantastic display pieces, and that's what they are. These are not toys, they're not meant to be played with. They're meant to look good on display, and that's exactly what they do. So I am very happy with these. So there you go. I've completed the set. Dusty Hayes is on his way. I'm happy with that. So hope you enjoyed that quick update. Uh, stay tuned for more, of course. So please like the video, please share the video. And if you haven't already done so, please do subscribe. And in the comments, let me know your opinion on these figures. Like I said, a lot of people are a bit unhappy that there's no vehicles, but for me, just having them in that scale, perfect for display, especially if you have your Star Wars figures and you can go straight into a mass collection. I think it looks great. But anyway, thank you all, and we'll see you next time.